Okay, batter up. Here we are. We got some pickups that we picked up today at one of the local card shops. Um, we're going to kind of show them to you. I know the lighting's kind of poor, so we'll kind of have to pick them up and move them around. So I got Evan here with me. He's going to be my show and tell person. Um, so here we go. The first two cards we got were the uh, Justin Upton cards. We got the pink chrome, and then we got the, what does it call these, a prism or some kind of X fractor. I, I don't know, X refractor, I don't know, it's some kind of refractor, but we picked both of those up, you know, it's Jay up. He's uh, no longer a tiger, but um, that's, where, that's where we're at. So we, we picked him up. So <coughs> and we got this Miguel Cabrera card, which is also one of those X refractor re prism cards, whatever you want to call it. And then next is the uh, one of the top's finest Cabrera. You, you know that, um, that uh, he's... Um, Kind of slumping this year, but we yeah. want to pick him up because he's a tiger. I know not everybody's a tiger fan, but we, you know, I, I like him. I don't know if Evan really likes the tigers or not, but you know. And then, uh, then we when then we picked up the uh, the next card here was another top's finest, um, Miguel Cabrera. None of these cards are numbered, but they're they're cool. I mean, yeah, they're really I'm not going to collect those me. sets. So when I see them, then um, I'll pick them up. So the next one was a top's throwback 1987 card. Miguel Cabrera. I like these cards. They're really neat. I really wish Tops would go back to the borders again because it just really it really frames out the card yeah. nice. So yeah. yeah. I okay. like this card. Yeah. This card looks cool. This card, uh, Ian Kinsler uh, from the Detroit Tigers. This is one of those uh, negative cards. I know I keep calling them reverse negatives, but they're actually like a chrome negative card. Um, I think these are the hardest cards to get. Um, uh, the non-numbered cards. I know the pink cards are kind of tough, but I think you can get those in those value packs at Walmart. But the uh, the black negatives are just tough. So, and then next card, Michael Fulmer, Detroit Tigers, kind of up and coming. I I, I know it's, he's not the team kind of struggles right now. Therefore, I don't know if his numbers are really going to reflect all that well because the Tigers have been getting blown out lately. And I know when it comes down to pitching, those guys' the ERAs are getting destroyed. So, oh, yeah. yep. And then we got another, no longer a tiger, but it's a chrome refractor of Justin Verlander. Just the base card with a chrome. Uh, it's not a numbered card or anything like that. So, yep. And then these cards right here were the last two cards that we needed for our 87 Topps Chrome throwback. So, Mankata and Luke Weaver. So, we now have the full set of those cards now. I think they go up here. So, I think Duffy's out in the wrong place here. But... So then we got something really cool to show you guys. Yep. So, but that completes all 24 of the 87 Topps Chrome, um, uh, 87 throwback cards, you know, for the 2017 series. So, yeah. So, and then we were, we were, the, I was at the same card uh, store. I know you guys saw the video before where we had the 1993 Topps cards, uh, that had the four Derek Jeters in it. Went through those cards after shooting the video and noticed that it was only Series 1 cards. And that explains why it was in an 800 count box and why there were four cheaters because there was like three and four of every card. So even with that said, we were still short like, I don't know, 50, 60 cards from getting it all done. So, but there's the set there. This set is missing, according to this little piece of paper, it's missing the Derek Jeter and the Frank Thomas. So we got the Jeter card. Guy at the card shop sold me the whole set, this whole box for five bucks. So I thought, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and take it. It's got this little bit of like mildewy look to it, but the cards are still really clean. So if you're collecting a base set, why not? And then the last thing we got, which Evan's gonna show you here. Oh, okay, this is really exciting. Yeah. Should I put it out now? It is a throw. We got this out of the three dollar bin. Out the back. Okay, yeah, sure. we got this out of the three dollar bin at um at the baseball card store and it is a Ricky Auto Joe Jimenez. I'm hoping this comes back as a numbered card. I don't I don't know if it will be, but we, we have to do the whole redemption thing. Um the guy at the card store, he warned me, he said, Hey, um it may be two weeks, it could be two years. He said, you know, just be prepared. So but there's a redemption code on it. We'll probably uh go on. I don't know, is this one of the ones you can uh, do online? So can be used one time, so I'll have to look and see if we can, yeah, online the redemption code. So we can just do this online, we don't have to send it out. So 
I'm curious. I've never done one of these. Never got one of these out of a pack, so I don't know if they charge for shipping. I have no idea how it comes to us. It comes in a slab, but we'll do a follow-up video on this uh, when it comes in. And uh, again, It'll be really cool. yeah, it's just another tiger. So you know, again, not everybody's tigers fan. I am, so I end up picking up tigers cards when I get them. But you know, happy to have the '87 throwback set done from the 2017 Chrome, and I'm really happy to find that Kinsler card. I did order a couple cards off of eBay. Uh, which I'll share with you when they come in. So we'll have a mail call um, video coming up shortly. So until then, Evan's going to sign us out. Oh, can I say one more thing? Sure. Okay. When this comes in, we're going to do a follow-up video. And it's going to be... Uh, do we unbox it with them? Yeah, we'll, just, we'll, we'll keep it in the well, envelope. Yeah. And when it shows up, we'll, we'll unbox it and look at it all together. So. We'll look at it all together. So um, peace out and have... Uh, uh, what was the other thing called? Mm -hmm. A, a good day. Yeah.